Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and to our brand new FIFA 21 player review. This is Leo here bringing you another player review, like I said in the intro. And today we are going to be looking at the best CDM in the Liga Santander and that is Frankie de Jong, guys. He took the world by storm, the FIFA world by storm last year. Everybody had his regular card, his ones to watch and then his team of the season, his team of the year because he was fantastic. He was super meta and that's why we're going to try him out this year in FIFA 21 to see if that trend continues look at that card man it looks fantastic he is an 85 rated cdm 80 pace 64 shooting 84 passing 87 drilling 76 defending and 77 physical definitely need to increase that a little bit if i am going to be playing him at cdm he is 511 medium high which are perfect work rates for a cdm right footed four star three star and yeah man that looks fantastic from face value and now on to the attribute details the 80 pace average of 80 and i'll probably be going up plus five because i am going to be applying an anchor chemistry style on to the shooting of 64 that doesn't really matter because he is going to be playing cdm so yeah let's skip that on to the passing elite level passing 86 vision 90 short passing and 86 long passing so if i do get to shoot is he a lefty or a righty if i do get to pass it by with the right foot he should go to the other midfielders to the other strikers and hopefully we'll get an assist or two with frankie the young on to the dribbling of 87 his best stat and yeah man good agility good balance the reaction's fantastic for a cdm and the composure of 90 talk about clutch and then on to the defending the best stat for the defending is that 82 interception so expect a lot of interceptions from frankie the young expect from him to cut your opponent's attack in half so yeah man hopefully that <laughs> that is the case and then lastly the physical of 77 90 stamina should last you the whole game 74 strength 70 aggression are getting a plus five boost so i'm not complaining about that and then lastly the player traits flair playmaker outside the foot shot and then technical dribbler i'm so excited to try out frankie the young is he worth that hype from last year we shall find out next game number one i kdb on that side with richarlison and alan ah yeah yeah it's gonna be a good game All right, first touch for Griezmann. Come on, let's go. Adama Traore, the young, there we go. The young stopping Adama Traore. I know I messed up, I messed up, I messed up. No. Oh my gosh. That's what, that's what I get for talking right there. And it's a penalty. It's a penalty, no way. How is that a penalty? I didn't even press a single button. Can we stop this penalty? We already started bad and it's only been three minutes of the game. Let's see if I can stop it. Is he moving his head though? Oh, he gives it to Richarlison. Vamos. Se viene. He's kicking it down the middle. Vamos! There we go. We stopped the penalty. But I know I ran that highlight pretty long, but the young stopped. Uh, Adama Traore, but then I forgot who it was. Diego Carlos just did a dumb mistake. Vamos, Frankie. He's doing really good in that CDM role. Let's see if we can catch, keep, keep up with Richarlison. Sané. Sissoko. Come on. Good side to side movement. That's that agility, man. Get that ball. There we go. Nice. He put a touch on it. Hey, okay, finally. He controlled possession right there. You're seeing you're seeing it live, man. That's all I have to say. Look at that good pass. Vamos de young. Yeah. Nice Michael Roy's playing defense too. He's doing everything. I just need that goal. Vamos. Let's go. De Jong in full force. I no, pass the ball. There's a, there is a delay right now. All right, vamos, Militao. There we go, De Jong. Nice. Vamos, Marco. Que pase para Griezmann. Ay. Come on, he wants to pass it. Keeping up with Kevin De Bruyne, one of the best players in this game. Come on. Good side to side movement. There we go. Good interception right there. Reactions, interceptions, and Young has it all. Come on, the Young. There we go. Another tackle won by the Young. 
So that will conclude game number one for Frankie de Jong. 7.8 rating for the Dutchman. He played fantastic and a true anchor right there in that midfield. He did not get a goal or an assist, but passes completed at a perfection. Perfect 22 out of 22. He was completed 15 out of 17. And then tackles won 3 out of 5. Game high, 3 tackles won for Frankie de Jong. And that is what I expect from the Dutchman from Barcelona. But anyways, that'll be enough of this game number one. Hopefully, he can keep up his performance in game number two. Game number two for De Jong, and he's going to be facing some sweaty players. Ay, 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 ay. Come on, De Jong. Let's go. Cover that pass. Good stuff. Side to side movement again. Really good. He does not feel clunky at all. Dale, De Jong. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Good way to get in the ball back, De Jong. A ver, de pase. Oh, oh, you skip that. Nice, the young. Come on, the young. Come on, the young. Let's see. Come on. My opponent's very patient. But I mean, so am I. I'm just, I'm just waiting for him to make that mistake. He likes to skill a lot. I'm not going to lie. Look at that. Every single play he touches, it's a skill. Look at that. See, I told you. Come on. You skill all you want. I'm not going to move from position. Covering all the... I'm trying to cover all the passing spaces with the young. That is the advantage of having a high pace CDM. Let's see if we can end this highlight clip in a beautiful... Uh, yeah, yeah. I can't talk right now. Almost. This guy's too patient. All right, let's go. There we go. Yes, that is what you love to see the young, the patient's pain off. Nice, the young, another cutting. All you're hearing me right now is saying nice to young because he is cutting everything on the pitch. So that will conclude this game for Frankie de Jong and he was everywhere on the pitch. And yeah, I showed you a lot of good highlights of what this Dutchman from Barcelona can do. Zero goals, zero assists, but man, passes completed, almost perfection. 12 out of 13, dribbles completed, 9 out of 9, and tackles won 2 out of 6. I was pressing some circle buttons and sliding tackle just to test it out. He didn't get them, so that's why that is a really low percentage. But I mean, if you're smart and not like me, he will get you probably 95% of his tackles won. But aside from that, Frankie de Jong is a monster. But for more on that, let's go on to the final thoughts on this incredible card. So Frankie de Jong, one of the most broken meta players in FIFA 20, makes a reintroduction and says, I'm still meta, I'm still broken in FIFA 21. And I have to agree with that statement because that is what this de Jong is. He is really meta. And let's go straight into the pros. Number one is going to be that 80 pace of his. I know I put 88 pace for Spanish. I apologize for that. That is a, a little mistake that I overlooked. But yeah, man, 80 pace. He feels like 88 pace, to be honest, because he's very agile. He will catch up to your opponent's attack and he will break lines on your opponent's defensive line and talking about agile he is definitely really good and he feels really fast because of that 83 agility so gg as well not much to say on that on to the third pro and that's going to be that 84 passing of his it is fantastic get it on that right foot he should get you assist and he should get the ball out of trouble when your opponent is pressuring on to the fourth pro and that is going to be that 88 reactions and you mostly feel that whenever you're on the defensive side he'll react to interceptions or balls pass to him so that is really good there and then the last pro is going to be that 90 stamina he has a lot of pros and that 90 stamina is key man i know there's not finished cards in the game anymore but he is really helpful helpful whenever you're in the weekend league and you go to extra time that 90 stamina will come in the clutch and he should last you the whole game and he may be I don't know his penalties but if you need a penalty shooter maybe the young will get you that on to the cons two cons on this card one is does have a star that is that's three star weak foot if you play him at cm you might notice that as a con but if you play him at cdm that would not be a con at all so please keep that in mind and then the other one is going to be that 74 strength he's never been known as a physical player so if you like strong cdms this might not be the best option for you and that will lead to a final rating of 9 out of 10 i really enjoyed frankie the young he is meta so if you're wondering if he is worth the shot or not i say yes man he is the best CDM in La Liga Santander 
for sure so go pick him up before his price rises but before i let you go guys i just want to say thank you so much for your support on instagram and youtube lately you have been killing it with the support and i love seeing that guys please take a second out of your day subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any fifa 21 reviews and that'll be all for today this is leo i bid you goodbye and good night